is going on, everybody? This is Back Now One here, and today we are back with a Black Ops 3 video. And as you guys remember, if I, if you guys remember, I said I'm gonna be playing um, some custom games with bots, playing against bots, just testing out a weapon, seeing what attachments I have. Um, here, I'll show you guys the gun I'm using and the attachments. Here is the gun I'm using: Cuda, foregrip, whatever the rest of that is. Just you guys want to use Dakota, Cuda, and I really like this gun. Um, just try and test it out, maybe if you guys want it, want to. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna go down the list on every single gun and uh, and every single map, just to get my opinion on the map. Like so, after the game's over, I'll give my opinion if it's good or bad or not. Like if this map is good or not maybe it's just my opinion guys so don't hate don't hate but um yeah and definitely gonna definitely gonna give my true opinion on the gun too um with my history i have not very i haven't really liked the kuba that much um it's just it hasn't been you know that get that like you know shazam to me as other guns have so yeah but so far we're doing pretty good. We're playing on veteran against the bots. So um, yeah, so we're just gonna see what we can do here. Um, so veteran is also the hardest difficulty. Uh, I just wanted to make this a little bit more fair, you know. But look at this, look at this. You know how it goes, it said I'm the sparrow. Um, I have the sparrow voice, but look, I have gravity spikes, whatever they're called. I picked the sparrow for a reason. I took the sparrow. Look, I died too with the sparrow, but um, that's that's a little bit weird. But here we go. Let's, let's get warmed up, boys. Let's get warmed up. Let's get ready for this. Get ready for this huge, huge victory. Hopefully, we can get um, because veteran bots are actually not the easiest ones. <laughs> actually, they're they're they get a little bit difficult sometimes. Like I was playing last night and I did not want a game at all. So let's just see what we can do here. Nice kill right there. Let's get back out. Nope. Never mind. But, oh, oh, gosh. I hate that. I hate that one. That thing seems so overpowered. No joke. One more in the aquarium. One more outside. This, all right. One thing, not a good range weapon. Not a very good range weapon at all. It reminds me of the MP5. And if you guys remember the MP5 from, like, Modern Warfare series. It, it was it was a decent gun, you know. It was a starter, definitely a starter gun, but it was just not not the not the range that you uh, you guys might want. But so um, but for sure, I'm sort of liking this gun a little bit. I mean, you might have to get used to it, like how it plays and everything. You might not play like the. It's definitely not gonna play like the KM44 or any assault rifle like that. It might play different than any other submachine gun like it might play the same as um the <sighs> crap I forget the name but I'll uh, definitely mention it later. It's, it reminds me of another submachine gun. I just forget the name. Alright let's get that cheeky little kill. Oh nice little quick turnaround. Alright anyone in the tunnel let's just take secure of this area or maybe we should run a little bit. That was for sure him because you can obviously tell. Um, all right, so another here. I'm gonna start another series on Black Ops 3. I'm just a little bit behind on Black Ops 3, I think, and I want to get caught up with the series with Black Ops 3 stuff. I'm gonna start another. I'm gonna start like advice. Remember, I started that like towards the end of Advanced Warfare. I started giving advice about the game and stuff. So I'm gonna be starting that up again. Hopefully, and it's a little bit earlier too. So that's a good thing. So, oh no, I can't see. That's a quick death. Oh my gosh, no, no, <laughs> no way. Can we get this kill in here? He ran. No, he's right there. Where did he go? Oh, he left. All right, someone in here. For sure. No. Yep, I knew it. Right there. All right, I'm load. Hopefully, he comes up. Right there. No. Oh no, hive, 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 hive. Alright, four more kills, boys. We got an easy little, easy, easy little first first game win. You know, I would love that. Hopefully we can uh, keep this 
Let's keep this stunning lead, boys. But um, so yeah, this is. I'm really liking um the Cuda for real. This isn't too bad of a like. I'll I'll give my advice towards the end. Just don't worry. Right. right there. Good one. Good one. Over here, maybe. Down here. Right there. Knew it. Darn it. All right, we have. We have gravity spikes with the sparrow. So, um, crap. Darn it. Alright, they're coming back. But we still, we got this. We got this. We only need two more kills. Alright. Just wait. No! Oh, no! Does that count? It counted! Oh, it have half of it back already so all right one more kill and then we'll be a uh, good for this one Um, I like it. Um, this is my attachments, if you guys were wondering. Um, Kuda, good starting gun, I would say. Um, uh, I wouldn't rec recommend it for, like, later on levels, maybe, because, like, you'll definitely have better guns by then, and the Kuda is just for, like, those guys who just prestige or just got the game, and you really, really want to, uh, want to grind and get some levels, and, uh, this is... This is what I like on it. Um, if you guys want to know the attachments, it's right there with all the perks and stuff. This is my class I use for it. Um, see you guys. Oh, also the map Aquarium. Aquarium is a longer range map, I would say. Um, I'll definitely use an assault rifle, not an SMG for it. But, yeah. So, anyways, I'll see you guys in another. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.